guys and welcome back to my youtube channel today is the first episode of drinks with the boo this drink is a mixture of we'll all be talking about relationships and what we think friendship should be like and things like that i'm going to let them introduce themselves first i'm going to Would you define a relationship to be like what would you define it to be like what's your definition of a relationship for me personally a relationship is any interaction that you try and upkeep with any person in your life whether it be an employer a friend a boyfriend a dog a cat <laughs> like any uh interaction that you try and upkeep with somebody like you genuinely try to upkeep or attempt yeah. Um, mine's the same like any interaction with someone in your life that's like constant and actually sometimes can be one sided so it's about to be like when you both try to keep up but eh. <laughs> oh my wow. god hey. Hey. <laughs> when you both try to keep up but eh. sometimes, yeah, sometimes honestly mm. that's exactly what is that not how you define a bad relationship when you're the only one there Keeping putting up, energy yeah. and trying to put it and the other person is not so yeah, I think I also define a relationship as um, any kind of interaction you have with somebody like any interaction you have with somebody I feel like that is you already having a relationship. It can be like a watered down relationship or a good relationship I find that a lot of people like when you ask them what um, when you mention relationship, they just start thinking uh, <laughs> Romantic girlfriend. Oh my god. Wife, 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 husband. Children. <laughs> babies. And it's like Calm down. Relax the fact that we have talk like we're talking to each other we already have a relationship it can be like a cordial relationship it can be a romantic relationship it can be a friendship relationship it can be a hatred relationship that's still a relationship that true that true, true. <laughs> negative can, one but it's still a relationship yeah it's still a, it's still relationship. a relationship you are saying like oh the jealousy is probably a relationship like, yeah. like that thing of let's say we know who who those people who like block you and whatever and you're like i've never done anything to you but like obviously you have some sort of relationship with I you because know, i live right? in your head but you don't live in mine Can i talk know about right block? like do you guys have you like have you ever been in that kind of situation where like your friend just through your relationship no effort but you just keep thinking first of all i'm finer than that nigga you were crying over like are you yeah. serious uh, what's in what, what's in your drink that's <laughs> Yeah. 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 Y
me i just known from time that i'm i've been like distance wise the further we are from each other the less Same. we're going to be friends i'm sorry it's not yeah. because of you it's literally because of me i just i just can't maintain because it's just it hard properly. to keep in contact it's like bruh eh. You know how there's some things you just you just want to gist your friend like like this. Yeah, like and then it's like no, I have door. to be on FaceTime, and then I have to like bring it closer to my eyes so you can see my tear, and then it's like bro. <laughs> so yeah. No, not for me. <laughs> well, Which is the like, country. Really. I can I can make it work. I can make distance work and can make anything work. I just as long as I understand how the person operates, I can make it work. As long as I want to make it work, that's what I think. Mm -hmm. No, understanding goes into a lot of, it, of how they operate. Yeah, because I way, like the yeah. way it's setting to seem like if you don't live in my house. <laughs> it's like, what bro, the? <laughs> it's like, bro. You look at my titties. <laughs> They're titties. They're titties. They're titties. No, like a uh, a lot of understanding goes into it because like I truly appreciate when people understand how i operate because like i could you me i'm up down sideways this way like we can speak for like a month straight and then like two months we won't speak and then the month straight we'll speak like you know there's patterns but people who truly like understand how i operate i appreciate them and i will also in turn try to understand how they operate you know so i won't take it like if my schedule's not working right now i will understand for you yeah. but people who <clears throat> They just, it's not even if they don't understand. They just don't like how you operate. And they're forcing something. That's an issue. We're not meant to be friends. Now you're forcing things. The only thing you should force really is a rubber band around a stack of money. Oh my god, I thought you were going to say something else. Hey, what was I going to say? A what condom? <laughs> I just understand all of this like of course on like explain to your friends how they how they operate and work with them and if it's not something you can do it's obviously like time for you to like move on and like, just that kind of thing that's what I think but I just I will never understand you remembering me when you're single and when you get coupled up you now all of a sudden forget me mm -hmm. i will forget you i will actively walk to forget you <laughs> to walk i will, walk will make sure it. i don't think She's about you and you know what you think about not you thinking people. about you <laughs> you people are setting the standards i was i was just like talking to this person and i was like oh i was talking to my friend but like because i saw you i saw because i saw you call and so let me come talk to you for a bit but i'm going to go back to talk to my friends the person was like as per you're going to leave me for your friends as per no i left my friends for you so i'm gonna go back to my friends um like what you are le you're you're legit setting the standard for boys no for our residents over there <laughs> <laughs> it's her. She's the one. She has the shoes. She has the shoes. <laughs> I have the shoes. <laughs> she has the shoes. And I'm not even in a relationship. So I don't know why I'm wearing these shoes. But <laughs> are you? That is the thing. That is the thing. So, so no. no. Ati has a you should, you, should you should take a sip. sip. Take a sip. My, my, drink. my, own, my like, own drink is different. So I don't understand why I'm wearing these shoes. But I. <laughs> Wait. Honestly, never come here to do the next video with us. She's going to be like this drunk ass. <laughs> I, mean, I think we're doing okay. Yours not. does taste different. I ain't gonna. Bro, <laughs> yours does taste different. I don't know what you're putting that. It's like, mm. 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 yeah. I just feel like, yeah, you're setting the standards. People now, like, your partner like, expects. That's actually very true. Yeah, your partner like, expects you you to always put them over their friend. And when it comes to me, I'm not going to put my part like my romantic partner over my friend and the funny I part is at this the funny period, part is most niggas I can never. most niggas don't even put girls over it's like never don't you think like I'm going to the boy I'm going to the boy I'm going out to the boy but it's our wedding day but the fight is up wedding day wedding day wedding day my boy even flew in from Australia you know who's going to get the boy okay 
Now me, when I say I had to go to girls' night because my friend she was having a heart attack. <gasps> then, ah! You went to cheat. You went to. I know your friends. <laughs> I know what you guys are doing. I kid you not. I've been in that situation. Ah! You went to go and fuck Tory Lanez. Are you okay? <laughs> my legs from my house to legs. the club and then we went to the after party for me to fuck not one a nigga that's shorter than you one uh, a nigga that's shorter than me too a nigga that's shorter than me and i'm the shortest one here <laughs> wow <laughs> really is taller than me no he's shorter than see? me see so you mean to tell me i carried my legs like that's you see that type of shit is like are you okay but for them it's uh -huh. we were supposed to go on a date we planned we planned we planned it's now three in the morning. Oh, can I come through now? No, me, I'm sleeping. Oh, okay. But I was up with the boys. Okay, see, cool. we went to watch the fight. Okay. And then you after know, all these we went a few drinks. Oh, and, then, oh, 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 oh. and then that one drink turned into 20. And then, oh, oh, oh. So, yes, I'm coming home at 4 a.m. Me, sorry, babe. You can't come today because the I'm The number you have called is not available at the moment. Please, tell <laughs> again tomorrow. Yeah, but <laughs> if you pick up the call, what do you call? <laughs> I think you said I'm right. The number you have just that. No, please say it in your accent <laughs> even the number you have called. The number <laughs> is unavailable. <laughs> and see, would you try again. again. Speak in main language. Tomorrow. Yes, okay? Bye. <laughs> and see, will be like, is it their call? <laughs> <laughs> nah, niggas be funny like that. Like, like you literally, that. time and time again, the boys, the boys, the boys. Women are supposed to understand. Okay, the boys. Women, we need to start doing this. The girls, the girls, the girls. Hello, yes, not the girls, do. the motherfucking girls, we the girls, the girls. No, the, we do. The thing is, when they see, when they hear the girls, I'm not gonna lie. When I hear the boys, I'm thinking there's going to be straight bitches around. Literally. Now the thing is, they see a plethora of men as they should because there is around me yes, and my friends. hang out with your friends. Like, wow. ah, so you went to go and cheat. You went to go and do this. If I had a dollar for every single time my nigga told me you're too attached to your friends, all you do is hang out with your friends. Why would I be attached to my friends? Like you are legit the one leaving. You're going to not like I'm not trying to say that they always leave, but you are legit like you need to understand you're the expendable piece in the life. Like you you legit just came. They have been here. They have been here, they have seen your fuck shit. They have seen people like you go and come. Better Probably even no, like to this is how like <laughs> I don't know which trip you've been since I've been going out of my life. Ah, I, don't know which, I don't know. I don't know which trip you've been since. She's just lying. She's just lying. So since so you've seen people going in and out of my life, yes. <laughs> no, Dennis, I really do value my friends' opinions <laughs> on guys. Like if my friends say that's a no go, mm -hmm. that's honestly a no go. Like the friends that I appreciate mm. and actually give a fuck about because you know there'd be some friends that be hating they'll be like oh you know yeah you're talking to you used to do so and so and so with me okay but we're here to that do so what do you want now uh, Wait, were we not friends at that time why we're didn't you kids. tell me like i don't understand like and your, your nigga used to cheat all the time have i said anything and he also cheats. have i said anything Wait, but like he didn't that's, though. Okay. this is one disclaimer i have to make though like if I act like if I actually knew or you brought it up to me afterwards, right? Of so and so and so happened with so and so and so person. Mm -hmm. I fully respect my friends. We don't even have to be at a certain level. It's just I don't want if we're friends, I call you my friend mm -hmm. and you've had a thing with a guy. I bet you even acquaintances, if I know you had a thing with a guy, I'm not going there. I'm sorry, I can't do that. It's like bro, I like to be someone who's seen my friend naked. Also it's don't do weird. it. Yeah, yeah exactly it's and also don't do weird. your jealousy things if you see somebody that you've had a crush on when you were in grade two now we are in university we're finishing and then it's you like, eh, you know when we Wait were in kindergarten we bumped uh, belly buttons together <laughs> what the fuck am i supposed to do with that i kind of also feel like high school is even far self like <laughs> Like you're telling me like, like oh we're, we're in just one now, in like. just one I kiss this boy <laughs> 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 now what <laughs> must I do like that ten years ago you kissed this boy no. and now now this boy this boy does it look like how we used to look in just one no no so but me. if a guy did me dirty like I it, it also depends on the time like that all one. all depends on the time he stole your rubber but if he, he <laughs> yeah so if this guy cheats on me like now and like he like he was so dirty maybe he was like even like um, emotionally abusive to me 
and like I have been telling you about it and then two weeks or okay let's not do two weeks two months later you're dating him okay two. two years for me even two years even two years later, three years later, pain and like let me not like with you. Two years, like, bruh. Two years later, you're dating that person. And you were my friend. You're scary. <laughs> All you do is break pencils. All you do is break pencils. Let's go around break pencils. Like, and people be like, "What's the big deal?" It's just like you're weird. <laughs> no, like, yes. That shit is very fucking You're creepy fucking though. Weird. So the whole time, like, let's say if it was even a year before, right? Now you're dating him. It's a year later after we broken up. So the time we were dating, you're like, Thank you! Are you okay? They will claim. They will claim are you, you just okay? happened overnight. Are you sick? <laughs> are you dumb? Or are you stupid? Or sick? Or Clearly desperate. sick. Possessed. I just feel like Demented. if this person, like, um, let's say we end. Let me not even lie. Even if it, if we ended in good terms, my house would still be paying me because I was like, all oh, this good things I was doing, that's good stuff doing to you. No, I'm not stupid. even worried you about, about sit down at least it happened to me first before you. Let's start <laughs> there. <laughs> Who taught him how to do <laughs> the spin spin double back? I if I was back a shitty one. one. So yes. what? As far as I to just rub the fact that I I spot it for myself for work. Would you come and sit down here? while no, you do? I will never ever think like all oh, the good things <laughs> that he's doing to you because one, I'm the one who taught him. First, the bad things that he did to me is about to do to you. Hey, Amen. On top of that, he already knows you don't respect yourself because he knows you already saw it and you brought yourself. So it's like, can okay. we even talk just hey, one man. bit about girls that be like, oh, I know you dated so and so. Like it's okay yeah. to adjust and be like changing. You can grow. People should grow with you, but don't switch up on them at the same time. Yeah. Basically, and niggas will be niggas. They try to. <laughs> What, what did you think about the drink the mixture of the two make sure i don't like spritz apparel <laughs> hot apparel spritz i don't like it but um mixed with um the prosecco i liked it no. like it, it wasn't i won't pick it but like on sunday brunch i would pick it mm. Mm. Yeah. I liked it too. It was like light and fruity, very girls' nighty. Yeah, same. Yeah. I really like this. Very truth juicy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I really liked the drink. Uh, I think it went down really nicely. If you have like, if you don't like, like the sharpness of like prosecco, champagne, you could like use that to like soften the the hit. It's really nice. I really enjoyed it. Orange taste. Um, yeah. Um, it's a nice drink. I would rate it out of ten. I would rate it like uh, eight. You six. You seven. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, bro. My pencil guy is just the best example. I'm talking about the pencil. You want me to teach you guac guac three thousand? Is that what? Or gluck gluck, whatever the fuck it is, but I do all the ones. <laughs>